Guess what, bro? What's up, bro? The bees made honey in the lion's skull. Really? You know where that comes from? Where? True Brewing Company in Denver, Colorado. Coming up next. Welcome to Brew Review. I'm Brady. And I'm Corey. If it's your first time here, please subscribe, ding the bell, be notified of all the fresh brewed content coming your way. We got the bees made honey in the lion's skull, and evidently that's a Bible verse, correct? Yeah. It's also an album by Earth, which is where they're getting this reference from. This is from True Brewing Company in Denver, Colorado. This is a heavy metal brewery, and I have been dying to try this stuff. It's a mixed culture. It's 7% ABV. Not really sure what the IBUs are on this one. I couldn't find that information for you guys, sorry. Um, so this is a collaboration, right? Yeah, this is a collaboration between True Brewing Company in Denver, Colorado and Perennial out of St. Louis, Missouri. And this is made with real honey, right? Yeah, uh, honey from both Colorado and Missouri is added into this mixed culture saison. Mmm, sounds like a nice batch of honey we got. Should be sweet. Let's take a look at this bottle, dude. Yeah, man, pretty hardcore artwork, man. You got that lion skull there, honeycomb behind the skull with a little bee next to it. You got the perennial and true brewing company logos on there. High contrast, this thing pops. Some nice calligraphy for the, the bees made honey in the lion skull. Take a look at this color. Beautiful, creamy, opaque, hay. Hail. It's really what I expect it from a Saison though. Milky as hell, kind of looks like that sea foam. Definitely that nice honey color to it. Nice lacing, let's smell her. Smeller. Acid, man. Citrus, lemon zest. Zesty. Sort of floral aspect going on. We do get those nice white pepper notes and this coriander spice to it. Pint o lime. There's a bit of barnyardiness to this. I would, I'm honestly kind of starting to lean towards Britannomyces over lacto, uh, lactobacillus. Smells like it's gonna taste sour and I can't wait for it. It definitely has a funky culture to it. Let's taste it. Let's. I can't smell sour and not taste it. Cheers, my friend. Cheers. Cheers. Ooh, that makes me pucker right up. Yeah, it gets you there in the back of the jaw there. Tip of the tongue too. Mm -hmm. Right as soon as that sour is about to like peak, mm -hmm. it gets like smoothed out by this sweetness. Mm -hmm. Bite on the on the on the sides of the mouth and the back of the jaw. It just kind of keeps drawing you back in for another sip. I'm almost getting like this little bit of a butter taste to it. Creamy, buttery, like literally like like fresh cultured butter. But it does have that really lovely, like, you know, Saison yeast going on, and you get that beautiful floral quality. Uh, really lovely. It's really light bodied. It's got like an ending dryness, but at the same time, it's got like this. That creamy butteriness. It's got this viscosity of like this butteriness mm -hmm. going over it. Yeah. Yeah, like you said, very refreshing, very crisp, but then it kind of mellows out towards the end. And you get that sweetness. Yeah, it goes down like honey. It really does. So what, where, where are you landing with this? What are you thinking? I get it again, man. This is good. Good collaboration. Yeah. Beautiful flavor. Absolutely. It's definitely getting above a four. 4.2. I agree with you, man. It's fantastic. I think it definitely deserves above a four. I'm gonna say 4.5 myself. I really enjoy this one. I could drink this all night long. I like the fact that it's not like super overpowering in the sour aspect. Yeah, it's- It's, it's very is... drinkable. Yeah, it's extremely drinkable. That was our review of the Bees Made Honey in the Lion's Skull by True Brewing. Pretty Very good. good. Thank you. If you guys like what you saw, please subscribe, ding the bell to be notified of all the new content coming out. Please leave us a comment, give us a thumbs up, thumbs down, whichever you choose. Um, let us know what you thought. Until, Until next time, guys. Cheers. cheers.